I'm still trying to understand, you know what I mean, what Coach Brown wants for me. You know what I mean? I'm trying to be more patient with my game and, and basically work on individual skills. But you know, we have team workouts uh, every day too, so I mean, it gives us a chance to combine as a team too. Say so you're trying to understand. Were there, what were the specific things you wanted to work on or address over the off season? The only thing going through my head is, is play like Coach Brown thinks. So I mean, basically the next pass where he wants it, stuff like that. That's what I'm trying to work on. You know I mean, I've a lot of uh, summer league and games like that just to better myself. Who really impressed you the first day of, you know, really the team kind of being back together? I know you guys have the open gym, but who's really kind of impressed you today? Um, everybody, really, everybody's working hard. Um, I feel like Sterling's been the one that's most improved, you know, the young guy. He's just going to keep getting better every year. Um, but everybody's working hard on the court, off the court, in the weight room, everything. It's just, it's been a better summer than last year. So, I mean, I think guys are excited. Uh, Coach Brown kind of talked about how summer worries him. Do you find it kind of hard to focus during the summer when you have a lot of dead time? Um, I mean, we've got class and stuff, so you don't really have a lot of dead time. But um, what I don't think he likes is really all, all the downtime we have to just play, you know what I mean? Because I don't feel like he thinks we play in the right way when we have open gym. But I know that guys are trying. We're having good games. So that goes out the window. <laughs> Last summer, was his first summer of, of an off-season program, and he talked about the you know the huge jump in talent that you guys had this year. <clears throat> Have you seen a difference in him and the other coaches this summer, or his approach to what you guys do over the off-season? I'm um, just real excited. Every every time I see him, he has a smile on his face, and just um, I think everybody's just excited for this upcoming season, um, what we had last year. So I mean, that's that's the word I'd say is just excited around here. We talked a couple times last year about how Eric Snow was helping you. Now he's not with the team anymore. Uh, like, how much is that going to affect you? Um, I mean, it's, it's sad that he's gone, but I mean, we have so many great coaches where just because he's gone doesn't mean I can't talk to somebody else that, you know what I mean, has a lot of experience under their belt. What are you going to miss most about him? Just his character, you know what I mean? When things are going wrong, he makes you laugh. And things are funny, he's kind of serious, you know what I mean? He just, I don't know, makes the whole, whole mood right. After a year of you know running the point for the team and all that, you know how much more of a leadership role are you trying to take the team? I'm trying to take full responsibility. That's why I'm saying I'm trying to better myself. So you know what I mean it's not about me. It's about what what my guys are doing. You know what I mean? Is that you're going to be your own style, your own personality, or you, do you try to emulate a little bit of what Nick Russell and Sean Williams did as leaders last year? Um, I mean, Sean, Sean and Nick was our seniors, but I, I feel like they still looked at me as, you know what I mean, the, the head voice and a leader on the court. But like I said, I'm just trying to keep everybody together and have fun. And You know what I mean? If I'm not having fun, they're not having fun. So just um, try my best. I know he hasn't started practicing yet, but how much does Emmanuel Moutier make your life easier? I mean, once I start playing with them, it's going to be a lot of fun, you know, a lot of open shots. and. Everybody's going to be looking for him, not me anymore.